Worldwide, there are 240 operating lead mines in 60 different countries. The largest producers are China, Australia seen here at the Century Mine in Queensland, the United States, Peru, and Mexico. Right now, every effort is being made to meet the ever-growing demand, especially from the growing economies of developing countries. The sounds of exploration reverberate through the woods of southeastern Missouri. If there was ever a physical manifestation of lead's future, this core drilling rig is it. They call it wildcat work. Going out looking for resources in places where no one's looked before. It's a kind of high stakes gambling. Americans are consuming more than three trillion pounds of lead every year, and the number is only going up. It is to determine the future of the reserves for the mine, and also it is to possibly establish new areas to find new minerals. They'll bore 900 feet into the earth, hoping to find their black gold, a new source of lead ore. A diamond-tipped core drill is attached to a series of 20-foot rods that will cut cylindrical samples called cores out of the rock below. Each hole has a new story to it. No one hole is alike, and that's what makes this very interesting. The core samples are retrieved with the use of a lifter tube. Then they're put in a tray to be analyzed and cataloged by a geologist. This is the treasure that we're looking for. This is the ultimate goal of a drilling program. And as you can see in this core, we have hit what we wanted to hit. We picked the right spot to drill, and we found lead. This is good looking stuff. In the geology lab, the cores are studied to determine where to mine next. Inch and a half of lead in a 14 foot run is what we call pay. Pay, pay hole run. This is definitely a pay hole. This will be in a, a lead acid battery in another year and a half or yeah. so, right? <laughs> right. Exploration is crucial. Think about it. All those new mini cars may save on gas, but as they grow in popularity worldwide, they'll increase the demand for lead. As time goes on, it becomes harder and harder to find. Eventually, it'll run out, and these mines will have to shut down. Hopefully, by that time, our exploration group has gone out in other areas and found additional new deposits, which is entirely possible, and we're hoping probable.